All right, okay, so for this problem, it says that Turner buys a new car, finances of a loan, he'll make in monthly payments. Payments are calculated, okay. Immediately after the 18th payment, he refinances the loan to pay out the remaining balance. With this amount, calculate the amount of the new monthly payment. Okay, so it seems like we have to figure out what the outstanding balance of 18 is because we want to refinance it by a new sort of loan that consists of the amount of new monthly payment that we're trying to figure out. So what we're going to do is that we're going to find the outstanding balance at time 18. And we're going to, well, first of all, how do we find an outstanding balance given any time? We're going to do that by doing the accumulation of loan. minus accumulation of payments. Now, so accumulation of loan. So how do we find the accumulation of loan? Okay, well, they gave us a loan of 22,000. They also said that payments are calculated using an annual nominal interest rate of 8.4% convertible monthly. So what is 8.4 monthly? It's gonna be 0.7. So we're gonna to have to accumulate this loan by time 18. Now let's find out the accumulation of payments. Uh, so the accumulation of payments, so there are monthly payments of 450.30 occurring every month. So these are the payments that need to pay out, be paid out every year. Uh, since this is occurring in every month, we can use the future value equation to solve this. So we're going to do at 0.7% at 18, right? Now we're going to use our calculator and solve what this one is equal to. So 20,000 is 1.007 to the 18th power. So I'm going to be uh, 2, 4, 9, 4, 3, point, uh, 2, 5, 6. And then I'm going to solve the future value equation. So I'm going to do 450.30 as the payment, 18 as the number of years, 0.7 as the interest rate, 0 as the present value, compute future value. It's going to be 8606.6. Now we're going to subtract both values and we're going to get. One six uh three three seven point zero nine as the value been rounded to point ten. Now we got the first part covered. Now the second part is immediately after 18 payment, he refinances the loan to pay off the remaining balance. Okay, so loan always a present value concept. Uh, 24 monthly payments, okay, at 4.8 monthly. 24 is already monthly, so we just have to convert the 4.8. We're going to get 0.4%, and we want to figure out this, the amount of the new monthly payment. So we're going to take our TPM again. We're going to see that 16337.10 is the present value for interest rate 24 number years zero over uh, let's compute the payment okay. 
There's something wrong with my calculator. So I'm going to get 715.27. So that would mean that uh, D is our final answer.